Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I'd do a colouring track from Grey Sail Colouring Book, Light and Dark Fantasy by Jade Summer. And we would do this page right here. If you guys have seen my last video where I found all of Danny Button's scavenger hunt pictures, you will know this one is um, a picture of a man. So that is what this page is going to be. And I'm thinking of doing this like a little series on my channel. So like all like the scavenger hunts pictures. I'll just put them in like a playlist with the scavenger hunts. So you guys can check it all out. And obviously at the end of it all we'll look at all the completed pages. But today we're going to do this page of this man. So we're going to start off with the skin. And we will do it in 28 fruit pink. So how is everybody today? I'm doing fine. If you hear noise in the background, that's just my turtles. Just a little pump. Yeah, I know, it shouldn't make that much noise. It drives me insane sometimes. But, you know. If I sound a little lame, croaky. I don't know where it's come from, but I've got kind of like a little sore throat. But I'm okay. So what are you guys doing? You guys colouring, puzzling, crocheting? Let me know in the comments down below. I'd love to know. I love reading all your comments. As you guys know, I do not plan my colours for my pictures, so... We'll just figure out what colour you see to them. I have no idea. We might do the whole picture on camera, we might not on camera, um, on this video or we might break it up into a couple of parts. Just depends on how long this video is. As you guys know, I keep it to a limit of like 50 minutes. I was looking there, I was like, is that his arm? And it is his arm. So this part here is definitely his arm. As you guys know, this book is my 10 to complete in 2021. And I have got 36, something like that left in it. And it has 50 pictures in it, so I'm not doing the best of jobs, but I'm getting there. Been in a bit of a colouring slump these past couple of weeks I don't know why I've just not been wanting to colour and just yeah but lately I've had, I've I've got me mojo back a little bit I just don't want to colour in pencils at the moment but I will complete that double page spread with you guys out of World of Wonder with Joanna Bassford and I'll probably do that next video and I just mix some mix some videos up a little bit I'll show you what I'm working on it is in this book as well and I absolutely I'm in love with this page that I'm doing I'll show you guys now. 
it is this page here I don't know why my um, brown on the back's like really sticky I don't know if you guys get that with your markers but this is hair it's my first dark skinned in I want to say about maybe a year year and a half because I am so scared of doing dark skins and she looks beautiful because there's no patches and I absolutely love dying skin when it turns out like that so yes this is what she looks like I just gotta do the bowl the water or liquid that's in the bowl I'll probably do that like murky colour because it's bones and then it looks a bit grim and I think this is like a shed or like a barn or something I don't actually know but I might just do that like I don't know I actually don't know what colours to do that but this will be in my completed pages for this month back to this page that we're doing to me he looks like a brown head I might actually do him like a brunette I really do like this picture. I'm working, I was working in order in this book, but I just wasn't feeling the next page. And I kept on flipping and seeing that girl, and I was like, I'm gonna do it. Our little puppy is really cute. He's been a bit naughty like the past like couple of um, days. He was funny yesterday. All day. He was just being nice and just normal. My mum comes back from work and he just goes on a mad one. Like he's the most naughtiest thing you can think of a little puppy in there. And I was like, said to my mum he was to go to and she did not believe me. Because of how naughty he was. And I know he's a puppy, he needs to learn, but. He's a, he's a handful, he is. And if you're not seeing my puppy, he's on my Instagram. You go and check that out. And I want to say thank you for everyone who's followed me on Instagram. I really do appreciate it. And subscribe to this channel, I really do appreciate that. If I could hug you all, I would. Mm. What I'm going to do is hair. And I'm thinking... Here's my favourite one colour lately. There it is. 21 terracotta and these are with Oli markers at the moment I'm just pulling anything like any pens that I've got today I know I usually have like a set of pens but I've just been feeling like putting colour on a page today Gonna be a nice relaxing colour and chat today. Hope everyone is staying safe and well. Looks like the UK is getting better. Like everything's getting back to normal. Which is a good thing. 
my pray prayers and love goes out to everyone who is suffering in this bad time. It really makes me want to go to a beach, this picture. It really, really does. If you guys have this book and would like to do a body colour with me, just DM me on Instagram and ask me. And I'll be happy to do that because it would help me complete this book. And this will go with a colour along that, oh shoot, I can't remember who does it. One sec, I'll go and get my little book that has all the hashtags of this month in. This is called... Posted by Crafty Underscore Colours on Instagram. That's what this this one will be for. I'll do his little ponytail plot thing in the back of his head. I actually don't know what they're called. I know it's like a plot, but there's specific like hairstyle or something probably I love this book it's so like detailed but it's like perfect grey like as you guys can see I'm straight colour and, and you can see how much it's like shaded and it looks really like effortless and that's why I like Jade Summer's grayscale and if you are a person that likes to colour, but you're not into all the shading and blending like I am, these books are perfect for you. I forgot to do his lips. I realise he's not a girl. Well, a man can wear lipstick, but I don't want my man to. <laughs> I'm thinking of doing his eyes. Hmm. I always land on green. So I'm thinking today we're going to do 65 Ice Blue. It's like a greeny blue I think this one is. Don't you need to put that much colour on them because his eyes are so tiny. I think. <laughs> That'll work. Now for his like suit thing. I call it a suit, it's not really. He's got like a long sleeveless top on. So we're going to do that. I'm thinking. Hmm. What would this be? Yeah, I love that colour. We're going to do it. 41 olive green. I'm going to do the pants and the out jacket with the outside of his jacket thing. I don't know what it's called. I think it is a jacket. These pages usually take me about two hours to do, so it just depends how detailed it is. I've already completed one this month, and obviously the other one I showed you guys.
What is the weather like where you are? It's been quite chilly where we are. I know I can use the triple sip, but I don't use that because I don't like it. <laughs> and every time I use it, I always mess up on the whole one, so. And I don't mind lines in the work. I like the scavenger hunt because I would never have picked this picture to just colour. That's why I thought I'll do it on camera because I know I had to colour it. And I want to colour every single thing so I can get you an update on it. So I thought pick this picture, colour it on camera, and then I've done it. It's not the favourite picture in the book. That's why I don't really colour it in. Like I'm now called the room because it's never brought to me eye. I swear my colour looks bad on camera. <laughs> like all day I've been colouring nice and neat down the camera. It's like all line and streaky. <laughs> it's fine. I'm enjoying myself. It's fine. And that's all that matters, eh? Let you enjoy yourself. So where does his jacket, I think that's the end of his jacket, so we're going to do the, or at least the top here. It's so cold. It really is tonight. When I film, I film at night time, so it's really, really cold. Usually a bit cold, but tonight it's just extra cold. I'm definitely just going to do them the same colour because actually no I won't do them the same colour, I'll do them a different colour. Like a black or something I think. Or like a darker green. Is it me or does he look like a little bit like a piece of pan? The colours and the hair just reminds me a bit like Peter Pan. Now that points out, I bet you guys like, oh my god, it does. <laughs> Why's got a little flute? I was wondering what that was. I thought it was a piece of wood. <laughs> now I'm happy I picked these calls.
Sorry, I'm a bit like quiet today, guys. Can't even get my words out today. All tongue tied. Behind his neck, I want to say. I absolutely love this book so much, though. I'll show you the picture I had to do next. I'm forcing myself to do it next, which is the previous one before this one, which is this one. But I weren't feeling it, I weren't, weren't wanting to colour her in, so I coloured in the other girl instead. But eventually I will do that picture because I really, really, really want to complete this book. It's stunning. This is one of my favourite grayscale ones all time of Jay Summer. If they brought more out like this, I would buy them all the time. Or if they want to send me them over, I'd be fine with that. If you guys didn't know, I'm still doing my hashtag all summer long, which is cute chibis in summer. Not in summer. Ch cute chibi summer 2021. I always say in summer. It's not in summer. Well, it is in the summer, but <laughs> that's not the hashtag. <laughs> It'll be in the description down below anyway, guys. I was going to start these videos next month, but I thought... I've got like 40-odd. Like 44, something like that to do. So I thought I'd start it now and it'd be nice to like look back on like next month or couple of months down the line or something so and yeah some pictures will take a lot longer than others if you haven't checked the video i'll go and check it out it's the last video before this one And if Danny Buttons does more scavenger hunts, of course I will be adding them onto the prompts and all that. And obviously I'll keep the list in the description of every single scavenger hunt colour and chat. So if you guys want to do it, you can do. But when we've done it, I'm going to put like a little tick at the side so you guys can also like know how far we are into the challenge. I am going to call it a challenge. It's not really a challenge, it's more fun to be honest. I had so much fun finding everything though. I never thought I did. I never thought I would enjoy it as much as I did. But I really, really did, so that's a bonus. Uh, I'm looking for this part here, which I keep on looking at this one, but I don't think it's the right one. Actually, yes, it will be okay. This is 104 brown grey, still with the elite markers. The pen just opened and then it goes on camera, just want to open. <laughs> I'm going to do this part of his jacket this colour. And I'm thinking it's hair colour to do that. And then there's strings. So 
Does his hair colour go as well? I don't know. But then would not be too close to his head here. Mm. This is what I mean, guys. I do not plan my colours at all. I know some people do, but I think it's more fun just getting into it. Um, do you know what? I'm gonna. And if it looks weird, it looks weird. But I'm not gonna do these orange belts, the colour. I'm gonna, just gonna do this part here, this colour. Yeah. It's with 21 terracotta. I really would love to know what he's thinking of right now. Like, is he waiting for his true love? What's he doing? Wondering where she is, or he is, or they are. It does look like he's really into like deep thought. I love making little stories up in my head of like my pictures. I think that's what shows it as well in the colouring. I think in this video guys we're just gonna do him because it's like half an hour and we're not even like to the background yet, so I don't know though, we'll see how far I go. I'm gonna do his shoes the same colour as this little vest thing, I think, because it's kinda going well. What I try and do with my pictures lately is try and use as little colours as possible because I feel like too much colour, it loses like the, the image, like you get lost in all the colour. Before you guys think I'm not going to do a sunset, I'm just going to colour probably that or like blue or something. Or maybe orange. I'm thinking like an orange sky for that because I never do fun colour skies ever. Yeah, so his shoes are going to be the same colour. And it is a fantasy. It is light and dark fantasy so you can just colour in whatever colour. If you really want to make him pink, you can go colour him pink. Any colour. It's your colour and book, you do what you want. That's what I always used to say. I think that's cheese or bread, I'm not too sure. I know that part's cheese and that's like a wine, I want to say. It's got grapes all over it, so I'm guessing it's wine. Yeah, lately I've just been in a colouring slump, but for the past couple of days I've been slowly getting back into it. Slowly. And I think with like doing colouring chats with you guys, it's really making me want to colour again. Because I've just not been in the mood for it. And I've been looking at pictures and I'm like, I'll finish that off Lisa, and then Lisa never comes. But obviously I'm gonna finish off that that girl and probably do another picture from here, I'm not too sure. Maybe I'll do that girl actually. Don't know yet though. I'm not really feeling detailed. 
This is not detailed, but it might be to some people, but to me, this is not detailed. You guys have seen details and it's like Wonder Morph. Wonder Wonder. World of Wonder. I keep on calling it Wonder Morph, yeah. That's Kirby. And that's a detail book as well. <laughs> and I can use my alcohol markers then. That's another book I need to like, get out as well. Quite a few books that I have got that are like detailed. That are just sitting there collecting dust. I just need to just get me pens or get me pencils and just colour. I don't give my pencils enough colour. Like, time. I'm going to do the cork through the same thing. Because it's bugging me. Belt. I'm thinking for this belt, like a darker, there we go, I found it, let's see if this is like a good colour, um, actually yeah, that'd be a good one, um, I'm not too sure, sorry guys. <laughs> Forty-two. Oh, sorry, guys. Forty-two. Bronze green. And I'm gonna do the belts on his. I'm gonna call it a jacket, and his belt here. And then I'm gonna do probably these two axes and that part in cream I'm thinking oh who's you remind me of now Mona Lohan me reminds me of something out of the Hobbit oh what's his name I've, ne I've never watched the Hobbit but I'm, I know the main characters but I can't remember his name oh shoot what is his name If you guys know, get, you know what I mean by looking at him. If you guys are a Hobbit fan, you'll know. I can't remember his name at the moment. I think it's the green and the suit and all that. It's just funny. <laughs> I just think of that. This really makes me want to go to the beach and just chill there. It really does. Oh, I like this page a lot of it now. It wasn't one of my favourites, and now it is one of my favourites. <laughs> but that's what I like about this book as well. Every single picture I've done in it. I've loved like I've not messed up well touch board I've not messed up on any of them yet like I look at it and go oh I should have done that different colour every single one of them I'm like oh that's a nice thing that's actually nice which you don't usually get that in colouring books like some people just look back on the pictures and go oh I should have done that different not with this book, I don't. This book I absolutely love. Like with, I'll show you now. I want to say your blue one. Where is she? I know she's not far. Show you guys now. Hold on. Don't know if she's in light or dark part. Huh? 
Okay, no. I like this one as well. I didn't like expect to colour it like this at all. I looked at the picture beforehand and I was like, how the hell am I gonna colour this page But once you start on it, I just loved it instantly. I don't know where that picture's gone, guys, sorry. I really, really don't, hold on. It's not that far, I know it's not. There it is. Like this picture, I knew she was going to be like an avatar looking person. Like, I just knew it when I seen it. I just knew this was an all blue page. So it's like, it's weird. But this page here, I just didn't know what colours to do. But he looks absolutely cool. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> so we're gonna do them little Alexas and his string on his t shirt. 36 cream. And this is still a deal with markers. I think for this part here, I'm going to do it that dark green. I know I'm a bit everywhere today, guys, and I'm sorry. And this little arm here is going to be cream. And we'll do his other little piece on this arm. The dark green which was bronze green I absolutely love that colour you can tell I've never used that colour before just not a colour I go to all the time What else was going to, oh yeah, I was going to do it here. Don't know if this is just wrecked or not, but, oh wow. Well. Oh, that's really cool. It looks cool. It actually does look cool. I think for the other little buckles, we're going to do it in 33 melon yellow. I'm going to do his little ring in the same colour. But you've got his little ring. If you guys have made it this far into the video, comment down below green. Just the colour green. As you guys know, I love doing that in my videos. But this little board here. We're going to do it in cream because it just goes well with me. Nice and neutral colour. Oh no. It's going to fizzle tip and. There we go. Sorry for the squeaky pen, guys. We're going to have a dark colour actually. We're going to go for wine red. I 
with grayscale you don't really want to go dark you really want to get stay light so you have the grayscale effect more on your picture but you can also go dark if you really want to but you, you won't have any of them shadings like you really want unless you're not really bothered about them and you can do them like afterwards with me i'm not really bothered about as i say like shading and blending and all that i just like to color i'm a i'm one of them people i just put color to the page and if it looks a mess it looks a mess but if i enjoy the process i enjoy the process this actually looks actually better than what i thought so that cream's going into my finished up pens, this one. Using the chisel tip. Oh, sorry guys. I think I'm just going to colour this cheese board and then I'm going to call it a video guys and then next video we'll just finish it off well like the next colouring chart of this page which will probably be next week because my next colouring chart is going to be from World of Wonder by Joanna Wasford. Which I'll probably be on Thursday. Yeah, it'll be on Thursday and then we'll have the end of the month wrap up and then we'll go back into doing this. Wow, this month's flew. be a nice quick short one today and then next time we'll just finish it off with the grass the cheese the little wine this little bag flute rock the sun and the sky and the sea He's took that long sit up. <laughs> it's because I didn't plan my colours ahead. If I plan my colours ahead, probably be all done by now, to be honest. But there's no race in art, we just take the time. And like I always say to you guys, I like to finish a picture on camera with you. I never leave them undone. And like, oh, I finish them off camera. I never do that for you guys. I always like to finish them on camera. So if you guys are colouring along with me, or if you guys have similar colours and you want to do the same picture, you can do and stuff like that. So guys, I'm going to call this a video today. Um, and the next with the next colour and chat in this book will be in the background and the little bits here and then it should be all done and dusted and then the next colour and chat's gonna be World of Wonder by Joanna Rasford. We're gonna get back onto that one. 
so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did hit that thumbs up button subscribe turn the notification bell on don't for forget to follow me on instagram and my facebook group page on the description down below and i'll see you guys in my next video bye guys